Hello, it's the IT guys here. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're looking at our top 10 keyboard shortcuts in Microsoft Word. So, let's get started. And at number 10, we have the shortcut for moving to the start or end of your document. A shortcut that will move you to the start of your document is Control Home. So, hold down the Control key and then press the Home button. And this will move you to the start of your document. To move to the end of the document, hold down the control key, then press the end button on your keyboard. This will move you to the end of your document. At number 9, we have the keyboard shortcut for hiding and unhiding the ribbon. This keyboard shortcut is control F1. Hold down control and press F1 to hide the ribbon, and then do the same to unhide it again. In at number 8 is the keyboard shortcut to select everything in your document. This keyboard shortcut is Control A, so hold down the Control button and then press A, and everything will be selected. In at number 7 is the shortcut that lets you delete an entire word at a time. If you've got a lot to delete, this is the shortcut that you need. The shortcut is Control and Backspace, so for example, if I wanted to delete the word watching, I could hold down control, then press backspace, and it will delete entire words at a time. So, in at number 6 is the keyboard shortcut for putting in a new page. Use this keyboard shortcut when you've finished for everything on your current page and you want to start a new page. This keyboard shortcut is control enter. So hold down control and press enter while you're at the end of your current text, and it will insert a new page. In at number 5 is the keyboard shortcut that lets you find anywhere in your document. This keyboard shortcut is Control F, and it will open the navigation pane that will let you find a text in your document. So, for example, if I wanted to find the word subscribe, I could type it in, and it will highlight it and take me to that in my document. This shortcut is especially useful in large documents. In at number 4 is the keyboard shortcut for undo and redo. If I make a change to my document, like this, if I want to undo that change, I press Ctrl, and I press Ctrl and Z, and that will undo that change. If I want to redo the change, I press Control Y. In at number three is the keyboard shortcuts for bold, italic, and underline. Select the text you want. To make it bold, press Control and then B, and that will make it bold. To make it italics, press Control and then I, and then it will have italics. To underline the text. Hold down control and then press U and the text will be underlined. In at number two we have copy and paste. Select the text that you want, then to copy, hold down control and press C. Select the area you want the copied text to go, then press and hold down control and press V and it will paste. And finally, in at number one, we have the keyboard shortcuts for save and print. To save your document, hold down the control key and then press S. To print your document, hold down the control key and press P. If you're from here, you can set your printing preferences and print. That's all we've got to show you in this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like, subscribe and leave a comment. We'll see you next time. Goodbye.